Alright, so for this video, I will be browning this piece of chicken. So I've already got it cooking. So as this piece of chicken is heated, the Maillard reaction will occur. During this process, sugars and amino acids will react and combine. First, this starts with imine formation, then Amador rearrangement to yield amino ketones. Then the sugar component will undergo dehydration, cyclization, and polymerization to create a wide range of compounds. Many of these compounds have pleasant tastes and aromas. The aromas will vary in intensity and complexity depending on the sugar and amino acid pairing. This reaction is responsible for the browning of the chicken we see and the flavor we taste. The compounds that we end up with will depend on the cooking time and temperature as well as the kinds of sugars and amino acids in the reaction. So we flip this over. You can see some of the browning that's taking place and that's the Maillard reaction.